Hello everyone and thanks for tuning in. Today we are going to demonstrate how to verify strength or holding force of magnets used in processing. Magnets are used for removal of tramp metal or fine metallics. These particles can be introduced at any stage of food processing, either from equipment or even from incoming materials. Over time, magnets can become damaged or lose strength. It is important to know the magnet's baseline and last verification check so you can determine if there has been loss in strength. The frequency of verification will depend on individual applications, but generally, at a minimum, annually. There are different types of test kits such as mechanical scale, spring scale, or digital, which is the Gauss or Tesla meter. Always refer to manufacturer's manual. There are several types of magnets. It is your responsibility to determine which magnets best suit your processing needs. Some examples are a T-trap, which would be used in line for liquids, Tube style magnets are used for liquids or purees. Plates, grates are installed in chutes, spouts, ducts, or can be suspended. These are generally for larger products. Clean the magnet surface. Even a small gap between the pull test piece and the magnet will adversely affect the test results. There are several things that can contribute to magnet degradation, such as a blunt force or dropping the magnet, if operating temperatures are exceeded, exposure to electrical fields such as welding ground circuit or generators. Zero the scale with the appropriate pull test piece by rotating the adjustment knob on top until the scale line measures zero. For the digital, press the zero button until it reads zero. When using mechanical or pole scale, allow the piece to attract to the magnet and position the scale perpendicular to the magnet surface. When using the digital meter, Place the probe on the surface and slide along the magnet with consistent pressure. When using mechanical or pull scale, secure or hold the magnet and pull the scale directly away from the magnet smoothly and evenly. Be careful as the piece may snap unexpectedly from the magnet surface. Note the measurement by reading the metal scale as it moves down along the slide barrel of the scale. If using the digital meter, slide probe and record the measurement. Repeat the test to verify the results and the method of testing. It is not uncommon for different individuals to record different results. By comparing the last verification, you will be able to determine if there is any loss in strength. If degradation exceeds predetermined percent of loss, the magnet should be replaced. We hope you found this video helpful on how to verify magnet strength. For more information on quality and food safety, please go to our website. And thanks for watching.